Jemima Glitter and the voyage of Bob the Bottle. For Jemima Glitter's birthday, she had a party in the park, playing hide and seek and eating cake till it was nearly dark. Hot dogs and gummy bears, all yummy in her tummy. Make sure you throw your trash away, said Jemima's nagging mummy. But Jemima said, it's my birthday and all the bins are miles away. After those buns, I'm feeling blubbery. So she threw her rubbish in a shrubbery. She soon forgot her tiny crime, something we all do from time to time. But storm clouds blew in overnight and the wind made Jemima's junk take flight. The paper stuff didn't get far, it tangled in a bush, melting quickly with the rain into a soggy mush. A hedgehog snuffled a cup with its snout, got it caught on its prickles and couldn't get out. Another discarded styrene cup ended up as a shoe for an otter pup. Then the carrier bag began to soar and was joined on the winds by a plastic straw. And rain came, and then a storm drain. Bottle bought at Bob's Cafe, bobbed, then floated clean away. While Jemima slept all fancy free, her debris went out to sea. As if it was changed by a magic potion into a plastic submarine, Bob's bottle made it to the ocean to float with the sardines. An albatross was paddling by in search of fish or squid. Below it saw the plastic straw and down its throat it slid. An old short-sighted turtle with a diaper for a bonnet mistook the bag for a jellyfish and promptly choked upon it. The carrier bag got caught in currents and swept across frontiers. Bob's bottle travelled round the world for nigh on 50 years. When Jemima Glitter was old and grown, with great-grandchildren of her own, on a far-flung beach on holiday, she found a bottle from Bob's Cafe, the very same one she'd chucked away. If only I'd known, she too late reflected. Everything on our planet is all connected, and now our seas have been infected. No ocean clean enough to take a splash. The sands drowned under global trash. Jemima realized what many knew. The easiest thing we all can do to keep our planet green and blue, it really isn't all that drastic. We need to think about our plastic. Recycle it whenever you can. Don't throw it down as litter. Get yourself a bag for life to save an ocean critter. And tell your pals on Instagram and Twitter, don't be like Jemima Glitter. You may feel like a small boy or girl, but the things you do can change the world.